Hey, what's up everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm actually going to create a NFT project that I'm going to be starting. I'm going to walk through how to create a collection and how to actually create and mint an NFT on OpenSea. But before we get into it, let's roll that intro. <music> Okay, so like I said in the beginning of the video, I'm going to be creating an NFT project on OpenSea. We're going to learn how to create a collection, how to create an NFT, and how to actually mint it on OpenSea. Now, this isn't going to be one of those big NFT projects that you've seen out there. This is going to be more of a personal project of mine, and I'm going to create a collection on OpenSea, basically of family and life memories, and I'm going to create NFTs of different memories and moments in my life that I find very significant. And I'm going to start this collection by creating an NFT of an actual 3D ultrasound that I just got today of my son. Me and my wife are expecting a kid in the beginning of next year. We got our first 3D ultrasound and I thought it'd be really cool to turn this 3D image into an NFT. And then it got me thinking, hey, I can do this for different memories and events in my life. So from this point on, I can take photos or images of certain days and and mint them into this collection and I can keep them as a NFT collection for me to share with others and to pass down to my kids and throughout the generations. And the cool part is that it'll be all on and live on the blockchain. So the days that they were minted, the days that they were created, all these images, they will live on the blockchain for as long as the blockchain lives. And I thought it's kind of a cool way of creating a kind of a photo album type of collection that I can pass on. So with that being being said let's jump onto my computer and I'll show you folks how to get started and create an NFT collection create an NFT and mint it on OpenSea now this can be done for any type of collection or any NFT project that you folks maybe have artwork or anything that you want to create NFTs for you can follow this same process that I'm going to show you okay so on the computer here I have OpenSea's website pulled up if you haven't already connected your MetaMask wallet to OpenSea you can go ahead and do so there should be an option in the top right corner Corner, but I'm gonna go ahead hover over my avatar here and go to my collections now I already have a couple collections set up here and I already have the Watase family collection that I'm going to mint my NFT to now if you don't have a collection already there is a create collection option in the top left that you can click on and you can run through the different things to set up your collection from the logo image to the featured image banner image you can also name your NFT project here create a custom URL slot Plug that you want to direct to your NFT collection. You can also add a description down below and you can add a category. And if you want to link your project, say you have like a Discord or Twitter or a external website you want to direct people to, you can link all of that in these sections here. You can also change the royalty fees. So the great thing about NFTs is anytime they are purchased or traded between different people, the owner of the NFT, you can collect a royalty fee for each transaction that is is made so if you want to you can select those percentage fees and change it here and then at the bottom there is a, the display theme and this is just how your nfts are going to be displayed in the collection when people click on it so you can choose what style that you want to present to your artwork or nfts in now all of this you can change uh, after the fact of creating so if you want to add a photo or change your websites or anything after you create a collection you can always do so after and once you're done you're going to hit create and it will create your nft collection now once you have your collection made you can go ahead and click into your collection you can see that i have no items right now in this collection and now we're going to go ahead and create our first nft and add it into the collection we just made so in the top right you're going to see the add item option you're going to see here that we can add an image video 3d model all the different formats that it supports are all right here max size is 100 megabytes the name of the nft if there's any external links description that you want to add now depending on your nft you can add things like properties levels stats all depends on what the purpose of this nft is going to be for and then you can also choose the supply so if there's going to be 150 a thousand of copies of the same nft you can set all of that information here now what we are going to do is actually take right here 
this 3D model that we just got from our ultrasound. And I'm gonna create this image as the NFT, uh, the first NFT of this collection. So all I'm gonna do is find the file and I can just drag it into this section here. And as you can see, that is the image that we are selecting 3d ultrasound and i'm going to give it a name and we'll just name this baby watase and this was at 18 weeks so once you go ahead and name the nft you can add a description or external link if you needed to link to an external website in the description i'm just going to put a little description here okay and once you add the description i am not going to add any properties or levels or any of that other extra stuff for for this nft this is just going to be so i can mint this photo and keep it as a nft in my own collection so once this is all done we're going to hit create we'll wait for it to load and there you go i just went ahead and created a nft of this 3d ultrasound of my son now the great thing about creating nft collections and nfts on OpenSea is you don't have to pay a minting price for creating the nft you will have to create a minting price though if you do want to sell or post a nft for sale if i had a collection i could create and mint maybe a hundred nfts but if i wanted to go ahead and post them for sale i do need to pay a initial gas fee on the first item that i post for sale all items after that that i post for sale won't be charged a gas fee it'll only be a charge a gas fee if you wanted to unlist the nft and take it down and not put it for sale anymore or if you wanted to increase the price of a sale all right so if i click back to the watase family collection i might have to refresh the page here to get that item back on it does take a moment because this is creating this nft on the ethereum blockchain so if i go ahead and just wait a bit and refresh it should pop up sooner or later all right and after waiting a bit you can see the i'm on my collection page here that i have the nft that i just created right down here and if i click on it you can see exactly the image that we up uploaded the description the title and everything is all here if i scroll down you can look at the item activity you can see down here that it was minted and it was minted to me and the date is set right here to november 2nd 327 a.m now that's not my local time but there you have it a really quick and simple way to create your own nfts on OpenSea. again you just need to create a collection and add an item to that collection and you can fill out that form in order to create your very own nft Tees. Now, I hope you folks learned a bunch from this video. If you did like it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and share this video with your friends who are looking to create some NFT, some NFT artwork, or NFT projects of their own. This isn't going to be the same process you use to create bigger NFT projects like you see out there with those 10,000 NFT avatars. There are other ways to create generative avatar projects, and I might be creating some videos down the line on how to do that yourself but this is going to be for those who have maybe individual one for one artwork pieces that they want to create and post on an nft marketplace like OpenSea. this is a quick and easy way you folks can get started with that and how you can actually start selling your nft artwork and making some ethereum in return so again i hope you folks enjoyed this video we hope you learned something and until next time see you